for the story people. It's an armchair. Somebody's coming. It's Grandpapa. Somebody's coming. It's little dog Fido.
It's another armchair. It's a dog bed. Goodbye.
present for the story people. Grandmama. Grandmama. <laughs> Mrs. Lady. <laughs> Mr. Man. Little dog Fido. <laughs> it's a red skipping rope. Somebody's coming. It's brother and sister. Brother doesn't have a skipping rope. Viva! <gasps> Viva! It's a blue skipping rope. It's a long skipping rope. It's Mr. Man. It's Mrs. Lady.
It's a longer skipping rope. It's Grandmama and Grandpapa. an even longer skipping rope.
讲什么？进吧。It's an old record player. Somebody's coming. It's Grandmama. Grandmama's putting a record on. All gone. Somebody's coming. It's Grandpapa.
Grandpapa's putting a bigger record on. Somebody's coming. It's brother and sister. sister are putting an even bigger record on. It's a very, very big record. Goodbye.
Ende.
think in Bubar the main thing is that you have engaged children totally with movement right from the beginning. Everyone knows that movement is good for children because what we're trying to do is to engage the children in recognition, recognition of what the movement is, imitation, let's imitate what they do, and then making them really happy because what we want to do is to make children feel happy inside. <laughs> The story people have been designed to be two-dimensional characters. Grandmama! Grandmama! They're like pieces in a game to be played with. Viva! Uh, and again, this helps children's confidence and helps children feel that they're in control of the magic. You're always trying in a script for young children or a story for young children to encourage curiosity. First, so you make them curious. What is this? What's coming? We don't tell them often until after we've left them long enough for them to work it out for themselves. We do use patterns very deliberately in Booba. Neurological research into children's developing intelligence has shown that patterns are very important, the recognition of patterns. So knowing this, we consciously in Booba made the patterns even more elaborate. Look what we can do! At the age of four, children have become competent movers. Whatever their abilities are, but all of them have a confidence in their own bodies at this stage, which they should be encouraged to have, because it leads to a greater self-esteem. Uh, we were trying to exercise a lot with those boobas. I think the interaction, um, the exercise, looking at the beautiful colors. I think it's really important that we should value every individual child for what they can do, and that's what the Look What I Can Do section's about. It's a real shame sometimes, I think, when we try to make all children measure up to one perfect model. The thing that joins us together most of all, at the risk of sounding soppy, is laughter, and it is the best thing. It makes you feel better whatever you do. Boobar is good for you. Yeah.